Behind every window at North Memorial Health, a story. Yeah. Liza Turretin crossed the street to share hers. That's Helena, Liza's daughter, singing to her husband Cole last month at the Mayo Clinic. When Liza's five children could still visit their dad, before coronavirus brought a new threat to cancer patients and others with compromised immune systems. It's a difficult time right now for a lot of people. Liza made a decision to separate herself from her children, they with her parents in St. Peter and she with Cole. Until I know that it's safe, that I, I don't want to expose him to anything unnecessary. As long as necessary. Where you go, I go. I've always said that to each other. Their son Oli's first birthday last April, a week before Cole learned of the tumors in his pancreas that have spread to his liver. More treatment options exist, but there's no overstating the threat to Cole should COVID-19 find him. This was our year anniversary gift, and um, it says, walk by faith. Liza has an ask, a message for younger people like her. Maybe there's a lot of people my age that don't see the importance of following all of the, the guidelines. They don't have a husband at home with cancer, and I think that it's hard to be in your mid-30s and think about those things. So if you still need a reason to stay home, here it is, a father who would like to get back to his kids. Yes. And a wife who will be at his side regardless. It's got to get easier at some point. <laughs> I hope that it gets easier. Boyd Hooper, CARE 11 News, Robbinsdale. A pretty powerful message for all of us. A GoFundMe page has been set up to help Liza and Cole and their family, and you'll find a link at care11.com.